Okay, before I um, get into the update, I'd just like to say that my server is back up. Uh, quite a few of the, the watch used to play on it. I'll put a connect link in the description in case you want to come back. So, I'll now get on with the video. Rust update 110. Uh, the first thing I want to talk about this week is a water purifier they've added into the game. Here it is here, it's a pretty simple setup. You put water in it through this screen here, turn the fire on, it purifies the water and then, well, it drips out into this bucket and you can drink it. It's quite a cool looking thing, it's a default blueprint, everyone can make one, and it costs 18 metal fragments and 15 cloth to make. Now, while I'm on the subject of thirst, your thirst bar can only now go up to 250, and in the dev blog they said they'd done that because they they kind of want to make you drink more, so you can't just fill up and forget about it for a few hours. So this is a nice addition to help that. Okay, now I want to talk about farmable cloth. Um, looks like my people who I've built with, <laughs> there's actually one here, have already got to it before me. Um, so basically cloth now gives you 10 instead of 30. I don't think this is quite ready yet. Damn it, so I'm going to go find a piece of cloth. Um, but I'll try to keep you entertained while I run over there. Okay, so the cloth you now find only gives you 10 and one seed. Now you can plant that seed and you can keep on harvesting it. You can make a little weed farm if you want, if you have such a great need for the cloth. Um, but the cloth is good, so you probably want some cloth. I'm just trying to talk about cloth while I go and find some, but I can't seem to find some, so I'm going to have to just fly off and find some. If I can spell no clip correctly, here we go. Cloth anywhere? Cloth. I'll probably look at this video back and uh, realise I flew past heaps of it. Cloth. Nope, that's a bear. I'll go over here. Maybe there's some cloth over here. Is there some cloth? Okay, so here's the cloth. So when you harvest it, you only get 10 and 1 hemp seed, and this is what it looks like. Then you plant that in the floor like pumpkins or corn, and then it grows into more cloth. Wow, that's a mission. Female clothing is here. Um, only two items so far, and they are the hide skirt and the hide halter neck. They cost 30 cloth each to make. Uh, the default, so you don't have to go and find them. Um, unsure if males can wear these. I can't test it because I'm locked to being a female. But they've been talking about female clothing for a long time now, and it's, and it's good to see that they've finally put some in. Okay, and finally I want to talk about the silencers. Now they only do 25% less damage now instead of 30, and the developers said they will probably lower the cost of making them in the future, because I think they're 20 high quality metal at the minute. Or 10. I think it's 20. So I'm not sure why, why they've um, focused on that, really. Uh, just one thing, I'm not sure if it's a bug or on my computer, if you put water quality up, it does this to the game. Let me know if it does it for you too, because it could be a bug, or it could just be my computer. Let me see what 2 does. Yeah, not, not much. Oh well, I'll leave it there for this week. Thank you for watching, you know what to do if you like the video, and I'll see you next time. Hi well guys, this is Spook, and I'm going to be working on opening a hundred boxes. Um, there will be different boxes, of course, I don't want to open a hundred of the same one.